Hello everybody. So today I want to show you how to answer. We have the formula in here. So this one that is about this one. Now we need to transform this one into this one. Next, we need to do common denominator. So this one we multiply by this one. So one minus one we can solve. Now, when we put number one go in here so you got number zero this one we have number two this one we have number three so in this case we need to consider about the limit on the left and the limit on the right so on the right that means 1 minus the value on the right, you can get the negative number because the value on the right is bigger than number 1. So 1 minus bigger number, you got the negative number. But this one approach to number 0. So this one we have positive number. This one we have positive number. So positive divided by negative, we have negative infinity. And this one, they are opposites. So this one S in here on the left of number one. On the left of number one, we have the value of S smaller than number one. One minus smaller than number one. We have the positive number. So positive divided by positive, we have positive. But we need to divide by number zero. So we have infinity. So that means the limit does not exist.